Looking for 1237. Target should be inside, but I got zero eyes on her bio mom. Fingers crossed it's not too late. Honey's. Oh, I hate this life or death shit. Hurry. Try hacking the door. Think you can trip it on your own, V? Sandra Dorsett's protected under Echelon 2 corporal immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta tech with... Mira, eyes up. The nails are hid. Quiet, me. Careful now. Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo Immunity. Our girl's top shelf. Mira, eyes up. The nails I hid. Quiet, Baby step V. He's watching. Definitely don't want a slug in your back. 
No way. Not neither. Take cover! Ow! Got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, jack into our biomod. Need to know what we're dealing with. Oh, this does not look good. She's in the tub of ice, crammed in with another. Fuck. Like slabs of meat. Keep it together, V. If she survives, she won't remember a thing. Tiny scar on the subconscious, that's all. Her people who live through shit like this get panic attacks. I'd ever known why. You'd be sipping a glass of ice cold water and suddenly your hands shaking. V, Jack into her biomon. We need to know what we're dealing with. Jacking in. Sandra Dorset, NC5 70442. Trauma team platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neuroport. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomon. Found the shard. Removing now. Check the biomon. Anything change? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Ah, oh, fuck! Flatliner! V, need to know what's going Jackie, on. Jackie, air hypo! Fuck, this is bad! Hey, catch, Vato! <sighs> I think. Holy shit, it worked! Fuera, cabron! Get her outside! Fuera, get her out! Terrace.
patient on the ground. Five steps back. Now. TT-133 to control. Patient NC-5704-42 secured. Stimulants being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for Venogen. Let's get out of here. Elevator gets us to the garage direct. Good work. Shit show's over. Cutting my wires now. See you in the near future. Listen, Mano. I got this thing. Mind if I borrow your wheels? Hmm. I got a day with Misty, but I can't take the metro. How's I gonna look for me? Won't leave you hanging, Jack. But don't get used to it. <sighs> Saving my ass, V. Thank you. How about I drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Oh, almost forgot. Should get Wakako in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. She's alive and well. That's what we agreed, isn't it? Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, give it right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you are to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD's gonna put Watson on lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Mano. I'm driving. Legends are born here. Starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie, they're locking down Watson. Remember? Oh, shit. Focus on getting home. Give me 
Watson's on lockdown to further notice. Necessary security measure. Officer, ma'am! Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes me so special? A uh, heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh-huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. She's giving me a chance. Waiting. Mm, that's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe. But he's a good kid. Let them through. But they're the last. Okay, on your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. So you can be nice when you feel like that. When am I not nice? Um, always? I'm always never not nice. your average badges. That's a max tech. NCPD's apex predators. MTAC rolls in when things fly out of hand. Gunk's up there, though. Just a midday snack for him. Well, show's over. Poor bastards. But they had it coming. your place. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood now. Kill V? Don't let me through. You sure about that? Oh yeah. I'll play nice Jackie again. Sweet dreams, then. <laughs> Gonna be long. Tell Misty I said hi. I will. Ahí luego.
Caught something when I jacked into that corpo's biomon. You know, uh, neurovirus, sir. Need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Yeah, throw on some threads, meet me downstairs. How'd you find me? Uh -huh. How'd you even know my Why name? Don't you fuck I know where to okay. gather my intel. Yeah. Could even call Everyone's me a collector. Yours. Later, you. V. Oh, no, no, no. Hey, yo, V. How about a round or two? What do you say? Don't tell me that's a Jin Yuji dress.
Imperial Local News. The Aratama Matsuri Festival is nearly upon us. To mark the event, the streets of Night City will come alive with exquisite multi-story dashi floats. The festival program will also include musical performances by Biwa virtuosos and theatrical performances in the No tradition. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation, and in an exciting development, even Hanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the Dashi Parade. From all of us at WNSB, we wish you a safe and fun So, uh, we didn't talk about yesterday. It's all in the report. Oh, I read it. Except there's no mention of me telling you to Delta Club. Sit down, let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or I just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but. Just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Totally the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold lady cool. So what's the gig? You meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself. Face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh... This whole deal works right for you now, I see. Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. All oh, Dex says he needs to check you. Talk to him. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Makako, but Dex is all man. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias, Where you know? Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our, uh, dust off with scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. I'm fine. on the gas, huh? I just ate. I was supposed to stop by Vicks anyhow. I got a date. Me and Misty. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know.
This is it. Come on, V. Find me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. What are you... checking them out? Hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. Vicky, spry as ever, you old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. Oh, wow. What do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neurosocket. I think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that could perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now jack in. You peruse and choose while I scan. See what's going on inside. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play by play, though? Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. 
Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Time. For the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm. <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. <laughs> I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er-do-wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Your heart chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you have to watch out for it. Do you truly believe that those who have so many mechanical eyes have resisted the I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. G, and yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. Listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll.
Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? You're either somebody, or you fizzle out into nothing. Night City don't let you choose. Oh, but it does. See, in my line of work, I choose to be Mr. Chill. But folk who try to take advantage, well, they see the beast inside. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah? Guessing it belongs to a court. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. No, no problem. Just a death sentence. NC's Arasaka's turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Mr. B? High risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no leadhead. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow because we're gonna do this clean and on the hush-hush. We understand each other. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First is a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second to rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Klein, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. I got a classic tale for you. Psycho Gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say went, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gang mate one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this ship's crew, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Send in it now. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is going to be all you.
One more thing, Mr. V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Dexter, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. Clem to want to check our pro cred. But to me, it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deeds of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. <laughs> then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. In that case, I'll hit the all foods and put my nose to the ground. Stay around. Hasta luego. Understood. I'll take care of it tomorrow. Anything else? He's still hiding. It's a matter of a few days. Yeah. There you are. Let me hear what you squared away. Hello? So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the gang goons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Ejone. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? 
that shit can go smoothly. This is Maelstrom. Gang world ain't too complicated. Might's right, the strong survive. Either you fuck others, or you get fucked. So, into the Borg Beast then? Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. I hate these Borg fuckers. It's had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? I take the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. Go on, let them know we're here. V, what you waiting for? Stout here. Start by telling me how you got this number. No more than your number. Heard you misplaced a convoy. You shut him up! What you waiting for? Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Nuh-uh. Not on the horn. Let's meet. Cut a deal. A deal? Hey, what you waiting for? Fine. First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm Channel under the overpass. Meet you there. V, what you waiting for? Ring a ding ding, Chom. Gotta get this done. Ring a ding ding, Chom. Gotta get this done.
look lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? Blackmail me, fucker! Set conditions! Got any more for me? Christ, Meredith! Shut your trap! That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly, forthrightly. Are you here alone? Yep, just little old me. It's the truth. Do a sweep now. Now listen, please. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? Come on, I want an answer. Never met anybody named Gilchrist. Is that the poor fucker right there? It's true, doesn't know him. That said, I've jumped a few convoys in my day. Know all the usual suspects. Bet I can help find your mole. But what I know now won't get you anywhere in that respect. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I- Him you can let go. Wanna hear what he has to say? I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment, so I could go that route too. Fine, the latter, but on one condition. You pay with our money. Sounds solid enough. I'm in. with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to fuck me in any way. And I'll be...
V, what you waiting for? <clears throat> Don't know you. Want to talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. Use a few plants, though. Oh, yeah. They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in the Chow factory. Uh, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. You hear about their boss, Royce? Dex mentioned him. Called him special. Who well, just mean us, Holmes? Shit. They expecting a whole Militech platoon? Anti-personnel mine. Directional shrapnel spitter. My favorite. Subtle. T0 D12. Call the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid Brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch. Planet. Jack, you called it. Let's scrap the bastards. You fucking mad! Hold on, on You know
shits! Big fucking mistake, you man! The Flathead, model MT0 D12, Militech logo. Said, bot and controller. Production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really, no other way.
shot. Ladies and gentlemen, Jackie Will.
Pretty face! Come on! 
mine again! Again! I'd save it for a new head! <laughs> See me here. You know, I like the way you operate. Maybe you'd do some more work for us.
When I say something, I do it. Keep my word. Mm-hmm. Me too. Heard one of the flatheads is missing. Must have fallen off the truck along the way. Guess Melitech will never find it. Pleasure doing business. Secure the area. Time we were on our way, Colonel. Holy shit, V. I was sure we'd walk out in one piece. Think we're done. That's it. Yeah. I had enough for one day, let me tell you. Hey, let Dex know we got his toy for him. And Fatso ought to crack open a bottle for us after what we did for him today. Ahí luego, V. How things looking, Mr. V? Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Met with Stout. Managed to strike a deal. Well, well. Gave me the chip with the scratch from Maelstrom. So you paid for the flathead with corp cash? No. Decided I could use the Eddies myself. And I just grabbed the bot. Just like that? Not just. Had to use violence. You got some balls, Mr. V. What about the meet with Evelyn Parker? Still on the to-do list. Uh -huh. That meet's the only thing that'll get you a chance at grabbing that chip. Parker will be waiting for you at Lizzie's bar. Good luck. City, your man Stan here. Reports show unidentified thieves are cleaning out Ripper Doc clinics left and right. Ah, the NCPD is tackling the issue the best way they know how, urging citizen vigilance.
the NCPD has raised the threat level to two, advising travelers to avoid side roads. We'll continue to keep you informed as the situation develops.
Thank <laughs> you.